Hi guys, hi everyone. <clears throat> this is a weird location me starting this vlog today, isn't it? No, it's not. I always start my vlogs in my room. My lips are so chapped. One second. I love that thing on my lips. They're so moisturizing. So basically, um, yeah basically i'm about to take out my hair um as you guys can see this hair is a mess i was thinking of going to get my hair done tomorrow i'm not sure but i'm kind of sure but i'm not sure yeah i have this set up here i'm gonna show you guys my setup i have my mirror this morning is kind of bad so i use my lost r.i.p glasses case to hold it down because it's kind of unstable so i'm about to pull up a movie to watch i want to watch mr bean but i don't know if i want to commit to that today so i might just watch love island i still haven't finished the season the season finale was yesterday should i say winners if you don't want to hear skip ekinsu and davide won Spoiler alert, that's what you get when you don't keep up. But anyways, yeah, Ekinsu and Davide won. Um, I wanted Luca and Gemma to win. I love how he loves her, like he's so obsessed with her. I love that type of love. Don't be creepy obsessed with me, but be obsessed with me, you know? Yes, yeah, so I think I'm going to watch Love Island. Or should I watch Modern Family? No, I'm going to watch Love Island. I'm so behind. Like, I mean, they've already spoiled it for me, so whatever. I don't even know how I saw the spoiler. I saw, I tried my hardest not to see who won, but I just pulled up something on YouTube and I saw I had this YouTube I follow, Murad Morali. You guys know I've, I've showed myself watching one of my vlogs before. He put it, um, Ekinsu and Davide's picture, and he was like, They won, yes. Um, I mean, they're cute, but I would have preferred Lukan Gemma. Lukan Gemma was a second runner up, just like season five. I would have preferred Molly Mae and Tommy to win, but they were second runner up. So, I mean, I like Amber, but not with what's his name? I can't remember his name anymore. Molly Mae and Tommy, my faves. Anyways, yeah, I'm just gonna watch it. I'm going to take out my hair. Um, yes, yeah, so you guys can just watch me take out my hair. Intended only for mature audiences. Yeah. Viewer just. Waiting for you to act like a human and show me affection. I can't stick my hand around you for 30 seconds. You push me away. He's probably used to girls chasing him, the perfect body, but I'm not after that. I'm after the perfect heart. Okay. Yeah. Oh, that's nice. No, I Um, you guys, I forgot to mention, um, I paused while I was watching the drama, spicy, but I forgot to mention that I was thinking of getting my hair texturized. I'm not relaxed, obviously. Um, I'm not relaxing my hair for five years because I've gone natural before. I've been through this process before. My hair grew, it was long, and then I relaxed and my hair started breaking out. That's why I had to cut my hair again last year. But anyways, that's besides the point. I was thinking of texturizing my hair because my hair is just so strong. Like my hair texture, I don't know the texture of it's 4C, 5C, 10C, blah, mm -hmm. It is so strong. Like this hair, I can't comb it out. My hair has to be wet to even like pass a comb through it. So I'm thinking of texturizing my hair tomorrow. Um, I'll let you guys know. I'm also thinking of getting braids, like braids, like with attachments and stuff. It's like take a break from wigs because I'm, I'm tired of the wig look, you know. Anyways, I'm just thinking because the lady that got this hair from, done for me, she recommended because I steamed my hair that day. But she was like, Oh, your hair is too thick for just the steam. That she recommended I texturize it. Texturizing doesn't mean you're relaxing your hair, bro. This is getting tedious texturizing doesn't mean you're relaxing your hair 
you're just texturizing it to be softer and easier to work on so i'm gonna do that um before i head to the salon tomorrow i'm gonna stop at a supermarket and get a texturizer she recommended olive oil and something else can't remember but yeah i'll just ask for like a good texturizer not relaxer texturizer if they give me a relaxer i will no jokes anyways yeah back to the island <laughs> yeah i also wanted to get my nails done i am just looking like a mess a mess my eyebrows not done nails not done my toes literally my toes are not done for the first time and i'm not showing sure as my toes because we're going through something my toe and i my big toes and i Okay, guys, I'm done. Finally, I'm done. Um, there's literally, there's literally dry scalp all over my room right now. I need to dust this off and dust off my bed. But this is the outcome. You guys have seen my natural hair a couple of times. I actually want to stand up. So let's stand up. I want to stand up and turn on my ring light so you guys can see. See? Okay, so this is the hair. We are done. What do I keep saying? We like you guys were here to do this with me. I did this all by myself as I usually do. Anyways, this is it. <laughs> okay, so I, like I said, I don't comb out my hair once I've taken it out. I just don't do that. The pain is just too much for me to bear. I can't do that. Considering I cut my hair just last year, we have seen some progress. Anyways, yeah, so this is it. Usually, if I take out my hair, I would wash it the night of taking it out or the morning of. But I told you guys that I wanted to um, get my hair texturized. And when you get your hair texturized, like getting it relaxed, you don't, you're not expected to wash it, obviously. So I'm supposed to go in with dirty hair. I haven't even booked an appointment. Oh, I miss doing buns. Guys, when I was in school, I used to do buns. When I was in school, I had relaxed hair, so I used to do buns. Like, I would sleek my hair, and it made me look so young. Or I would sleek my hair down. Um, it made me look so young. I miss doing buns. Okay, I miss doing buns. Well, with this natural hair, is really hard. I just hope that I see um, a difference when I texturize my hair. And yeah, I can, once I touch around my hair, I can at least do a bun or like a ponytail without having to do a frontal because I do have good hair. Like, I have hair. I don't need a frontal. Frontal is for girls who don't have front hair. I'm sorry. I mean, I will do the frontal look once in my life or a couple of times or whatever. I'm rambling at this point. I'm done. I'm actually hungry. So I'm going to fix myself something to eat. Maybe bread. I need to order food because I don't have dinner and I'm not going anywhere today. But yeah, I need to order food and book an appointment. I want to try out um, Lamy's hair. She's my friend's friend and she owns a salon. And my friend is always like, oh, you should try it out, you should try it out. So that's what I want to do. I'm going to try to book an appointment there tomorrow. Um, yeah. Hi guys. So it's the morning of my hair appointment is today. <clears throat> I don't know if you guys can hear me trying to talk low because my throat hurts. Anyways, my hair appointment is today. I'm kind of running late, so I just want to do this like real quick. This is the state of my hair. I haven't washed it, haven't combed it out. It's really bad. Um, my room is a mess because there's literally hair everywhere. So I just figured when I go back, I'll clean up. But yeah, this is it. You can even see hair falling off. So it's really crazy. Um, I'm going to texturize it now. Yeah. So I'll talk to you guys um, when I'm at the salon. I'm really shy to vlog in public. So this is going to be a task for me. 
um, definitely a task, but I should be able to do it. I also want to make a reel of my hair transformation. So, fingers crossed, I, you know, have the courage. I was thinking of taking, like, two shots of vodka to give me courage, but, child, it's 10 a.m. in the morning. Why are you drinking? <laughs> Anyways, yeah, I should stop playing with it. Like, my room is a mess. It's filled with hair. But, yeah, I'm about to leave my house. Head into the salon, and I will talk to you guys. It's currently 11 p.m. I left my house by 11 a.m. Tell me why it's 11 p.m. and I'm just getting back. But that's besides the point. You know me. Once I leave my house and move to that side of the town, I tend to see my friends, tend to spend time with my friends. So basically, I was at the salon. My friend Hilda came to the salon just a coincidence to drop off her sister to make her hair and then my friend beverly came over to visit and then we went to hilda's we went to beverly's we ate it was you know anyways i actually got done with this hair late i finished this hair by like 8 p.m so um just different things um my hair is natural so it takes you quite a longer time to maneuver but that's besides the point the whole the point of this video is i'm done and i want to show you guys my hair look at this this hair is stunning i'm going to try and put like clips here i'll stand here so i can put clips here of you know the hair um the videos we made right after i got out of the salon they're really cute like showing you in-depth hair like it's really neat and everything I'll put the videos right here let's watch it together let's go ooh, ah ooh. no right here ooh. ah this is beautiful oh my god so neat okay <laughs> anyways i went to a salon lamy's i can't remember the name lamy beauty so i'll put the name right here the instagram handle i'm going to put them here i went to her salon they you know they're really talented great job great job like look at this they're really talented they're really really talented so i'm going to put the link right here let's put the name the instagram name down below but yeah this is the finished look this is me i texturized my hair you guys i said i was going to talk about this texturizing process so yeah i don't know if i'm going to do the texturizing thing again i just feel like texturizing hair just doesn't work with my hair because i texturized my hair simply because um i was recommended like someone recommended oh i texturized my hair to help with the texture obviously to help with the pain help with the you know working with my hair to help so i decided to texturize my hair and that's what i did today it worked i mean my hair was really soft when it was wet but the blow the the blow drying process was a nightmare like it works with my wet hair like it worked it softened my hair i feel like my hair like if i gave my pain um the pain level of getting my hair done before texturizing it was like a hundred okay i'm not like 80 <laughs> but the pain level after texturizing was like a 60 so not much of a difference you know 40 percent difference not much of a difference there was a little difference like i saw a little difference but it wasn't much i still felt a lot of pain i still was in a lot of pain i still went through a lot of pain i'm still in a lot of pain but that's because like this is fresh air obviously i'm going to be in a lot of pain yeah so i'm just like i don't know how i feel about texturizing i don't know it really didn't like 
do what I thought it would do. I thought like once I get my all my hair texturized, I like I was on top of the world. I could get a ponytail. I could do a bun. Like I thought my hair was supposed to be, but it really didn't give what it was supposed to give. So yeah. But all in all, my hair came out lovely. I love it. Let me show you guys the back. So yeah, I decided to twist. I decided to go for twisting. Here it is. I decided to twist. You know, everybody just does the normal braiding, but I decided I wanted to twist my hair. Yeah, so I really, 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 really love it. Like I'm really not one to love my braids, like my hair, any hair I make, except if it's like all back. I'm really not one to love like my hair on the day that I make it. I really want to like give it like three days to a week before I actually love it. But this hair, I feel in instant love. Like I love it. And you see, it's a it's bit. It's really nice. You guys will see in this portion. Anyways, it's 11 p.m. and you know your girl is tired. I'm really exhausted. So I thought when I got back, I was going to clean my room and like do like a clean it clean with me video. But I'm actually going to leave that for tomorrow because I'm really tired. I mean, it also pain in my hair. I'm just going to take some painkillers, have my shower, and literally call it a night. So yeah, I think this is the end of this video. I showed you guys. You guys are following me to make my hair. I told you I was not really good at vlogging. So I mean, I tried. You saw some snippets. But yeah, this is really the end. I hope, you know, you guys got some inspiration. If you wanted to relax your hair, if you wanted to make this hairstyle, you know, some inspo. Um, yeah, I'll talk to you guys in the next video. Like, comment, subscribe. Bye.